Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. If you would like to set your toolbar and menu bar options, you may choose Tools and Customize from the menu bar, and then choose the Options tab. Here we have some options for how PowerPoint should show its toolbars and menu bars. So for example, showing standard and formatting toolbars on two rows. By default, PowerPoint XP and 2003 show them on one line, um, hiding half the buttons basically. So usually I recommend that most people check show standard formatting toolbars on two rows. Also, if you would like to always show the full commands when you click the menu drop downs, you can check always show full menus. That's a really helpful feature once again when you're learning the program. Other things you can do here are use large icons, which is helpful if you're having problems seeing buttons listing the font names in their font, which always shows the different font names in the drop-down in the actual font, and showing screen tips on toolbars. You can even show shortcut keys in the screen tips, which is another way to learn your keyboard shortcuts. So when you'd set any options that you wanted, just click close, and you would then see those options applied. So notice my standard and formatting toolbars are on two rows. And anytime I click a menu, I see all the commands, not just some of them. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.